Hi, I'm Joe from A Smarter Home Canada. Last week, I got my first Amazon smart speaker device. I did a video about it. You can see the video up above or down below in the comments. Follow the link. It's a full unboxing, review, and setup of the Echo Spot for 2024. If you did watch that video closely, you might have noticed that at the beginning of the video, all the temperature units were in Fahrenheit, but by the end of the video, it had switched over to Celsius. You see, in Canada, we use the metric system. However, we're not very good at sticking to that. For example, when we're measuring weight, some items we use pounds for, like I know my weight in pounds. I don't know my weight in kilograms. If I'm going to buy apples, I buy a pound of apples. I don't buy a kilogram of apples. Distance, kind of the same thing. If it's under 10 meters, we tend to use feet and inches, such as my height, the height of my neighbor's fence. That's all done in feet. But for longer measurements, Alexa, what's the distance to Toronto City Hall? I found a Toronto. It is 262.5 kilometers away on 100 Queen Street West in Toronto. So if we're traveling any distance at all, that tends to be kilometers. Temperature is kind of the same. We tend to use a mixture of measurements. Temperature of your oven? Fahrenheit. Temperature of your hot tub? Fahrenheit. The weather? Celsius. Unless it's super hot. If it's around 32, 33 degrees, we tend to slip over and start using Fahrenheit and start saying it's above 90 today. I don't know why that is. Anyways, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to make your Amazon smart speaker a little bit more Canadian. Not only are we gonna fix the measurement settings, I'm gonna show you how to turn your Alexa into a more Canadian Alexa. Even though the new Amazon Echo Spot does have a touch screen on it with settings, you cannot change the settings on the Amazon Echo itself. We have to go to the app. And to do that, I'm just going to show you what to do over here. First thing we're going to change is the measurements. Once you have the Amazon app open, click on the more button at the bottom of the screen. It's the one with the three squares and the plus symbol. This is going to get you to another menu where you're going to click on the gear icon, which is the settings menu. And under that menu, you're going to click on Alexa app settings. Finally, buried under all these menu options, at the very bottom, you're going to see measurements. And it's going to show you right there your default measurements, which are going to be Fahrenheit and miles at this point. Click on that menu option. Switch those options from Fahrenheit to Celsius and miles to kilometers. Once you have the check marks beside, you're going to go to the top corner and it's going to say sync and it's going to show all your Amazon Alexa speakers and you're going to click all of them and it's going to change all those settings on those all at once. Exit out and you're done. Your Alexas are now a little bit more Canadian. Next thing we're going to do is make it fully Canadian. I'm not going to tell you what the setting is we're going to change until we actually get there. But once again, you're going to open up your Alexa app. And from home, Why? from the home screen, you're once again going to hit that more button in the bottom corner, go to settings, go to device settings this time. And this time you're going to find the speaker. And in this case, it's Joe's Echo Spot. You're going to click the settings icon at the top. And this is going to bring you into that device's settings. You can change any of these if you want, but we're going to scroll down to Alexa's voices. And here you're going to find two Canadian voices that you can choose from. Moose, Goose, Toonie, Looney. These are some of my favorite words with this voice. There's an official league for rock, paper, scissors. If you want to play some time, I'm game. I think it's kind of nice that now we have a recognizable accent to go along with the Australians, the British, and the Indian. I think this is a really good setting from Amazon. Pick whichever voice you like, and now your Alexa has been Canadianified. So that's just two quick settings you can change to make your Amazon a little more Canadian. I know it's not an important video, but I had fun doing it. If you want to see more, Click on the like and subscribe button. We'll see you here next time. Until next time, I'm just an old Canadian guy in his new Canadian home trying to make it a little bit smarter and having some fun while doing it. Thanks for watching.